My name is Henning Davane. I come from the martial arts world. Martial arts means fighting sports. Fighting sports is things like boxing, karate, kung fu, kickboxing, jiu-jitsu, Brazilian jiu-jitsu, all this is fighting sports. I did uh, fighting martial arts for 30 years. I was a professional for 20 years. I taught the police, special forces within the police, I taught the military, special forces within the military and normal uh, martial arts enthusiasts from around the world. I used to travel from south, like uh, Chile, Viña del Mar, a little south of Santiago, if you're known in South America, to Helsinki in the north. And now this program is about meditation and mindfulness, and I'm telling you about fighting. And that is because in the world there are two separate traditions of meditation and mindfulness. One relates to monks who lives in monasteries, and one relates to martial artists who utilize meditation, breathing, and mindfulness as a path towards uh, higher performance and self-knowledge. So I'm pursuing this part, and I'm going to share with you in this course some of the tools that we use to have increased performance and have um, balance our stress in uh, in life. But when we talk about uh, spirituality within the martial arts, it means your capacity for presence. How much of your capacity can you bring into the uh, activity that you engage in? The more you do that, the more you're connected with this part of you, which is presence. For excelling in these parts, we're using mental strategies, breathing techniques, and uh, mindfulness and meditation techniques. So I'm going to share those with you in uh, this course. You may appreciate that in your life you have many things to attend to. There are many jobs you need to finish, and that can be quite stressful sometimes. To have stress is something we, we hear a lot about, but actually people can handle a lot of stress. People, human beings are, are um, built to handle a lot of stress. But what we are not built to is to handle continuous stress without a break. So what we need to learn is to balance how much we stress, which is one part of our nervous systems that got to do with fight and flight, and the opposite where we call rest and digest, we can relax. If you can balance those two, you can take a lot of stress if you know how to balance it. And if you look at a martial artist, you can understand that it's a very stressful activity because you actually go in and you hand physically handle yourself in a life-threatening situation. And if you go into the ring, there will be many people looking. It's a, it's, it's a high performance and very stressful occupation. The reason that martial artists don't get uh, stressful in spite of all the stress, physical, emotional, and mental stress they are exposed to, is that we have tools to handle our nervous systems and get the stress out of the, uh, of the body and balance the nervous system in ways that doesn't allow the stress to accumulate. These are the strategies I'm going to teach you throughout this course. And what you'll get from it is you'll get more inner peace, you'll get more mental clarity and you'll become happier as well.